Hey, Keller Williams. My name is Meg, and I'm a training specialist on the KWU tech training team. Our team trains agents and leaders in the field, just like you, on command and its integrated technologies. Today, I want to talk about one of those integrated technologies called DocuSign, one of my favorites. I want to show you how to use packets within DocuSign rooms. Let's go take a look. Once you're in your DocuSign room, and again, this is for KW DocuSign accounts, you're going to notice when we want to add an interactive DocuSign form to our room, we click on the blue Add button in the top right. We select DocuSign Forms. Now, on the left-hand side of this pop-up, we're going to see the word Packets. Think of packets as groupings of forms, making it easier for you to find the exact form that you need in order to get that client signature on. So we can see in my DocuSign account here, I've got a lot of these packets. Well, these used to only be created by your market center. And now DocuSign has allowed you to create your own form packets. I'm going to show you where to go to create these packets, and then we'll come back here to take a look at how that helps us bring in forms faster to our room. In order to create these packets, we're going to move out of rooms at the top and navigate over to My Documents. Within the My Documents tab is where we'll see we're under the Forms tab here, and the first option we'll see is My Packets. Notice there's no packets currently existing in my account. This is a newer feature, and now I can add packets to make it easier for me to find the forms I need. First thing we'll do, navigate to the right-hand side and select New Packet. This is us creating our own unique packet. It's personalized to us. It is not shareable at this time. First thing we need to do is give it a name. If you're anything like me, I would highly recommend you maybe start off with uh, a letter A or number one, just making this packet top when you're going to look for it later. I'll show you what I mean in just a moment. We'll give it a name and hit continue. Now, we need to select the library that houses the forms we want to add to this packet. Select, select, and then pick the library in which the forms live. You can see in my account, I've just got the one library. All my forms live here. Use selected, and now it's going to show you the options for the DocuSign forms you can add to this packet. I'm going to say we need that release of earnest money, notice of withdrawal and hit save. That's it. I've just created my own packet with forms that I need to easily access for uploading to my room, interacting with, and then sending out for client signature. If I made a mistake, I can select the three dots on this packet name, can edit the packet, make a copy, or delete it. Again, packets right now here under my documents, my packets, these are unique to me. I need to create them. I cannot share them with others. So let's go take a look at what this looks like now when we're back in our room. Navigate to rooms in the top. Click on the room I was just in. We'll go back to that documents tab. And now when I go to click on add, DocuSign Forms, there it is, that packet I just created, number one listing packet docs. I could have even included my own name in this to make it easier to find. And now I see those forms here and I can easily bring them into my room. This is a really cool feature. Many agents were originally asking if they could create these type of packets to make it easier for them. Now you can. I trust this has been helpful to you and your business. If you have any questions, you can please reach out to our team, the KWU Tech Training Team. Learn command at kw.com is our email. My name is Meg, and I look forward to seeing you in a training soon. Thank you so much. Have a great day.